In sad news from Hollywood this morning, actress Elizabeth Pena, who had roles in Down and Out in Beverly Hills, La Bamba, Lone Star, Rush Hour, and The Incredibles, died Tuesday in Los Angeles after a brief illness, according to her manager, Gina Rugolo. She was 55 years old. Pena was a much-loved member of the acting community and, in addition to her film roles, had multiple television roles, including a recurring guest role on Modern Family, playing the mother of Sofia Vergara's character, and appeared regularly on the current crime drama, Matador. She also directed a few episodes of television shows and was a founding member of the Hispanic Organization of Latin Actors. Pena was born September 23, 1959, in Elizabeth, New Jersey, and spent part of her childhood in Cuba with her family. Her father, Mario, was an actor, writer, and director, and her mother, Estella Margarita, was a producer and arts administrator. According to the LA Times, when Pena was filming Lone Star, the 1996 film set on the Texas-Mexico border, she worked hard to portray her schoolteacher character properly, taking time to carefully research the role by immersing herself in the community there. In the last decade, Pina also lent her voice to a number of animated characters, including Mirage in Pixar's The Incredibles in 2004, and to characters in the television series Maya and Miguel, Justice League, and American Dad. Pina is survived by her husband Hans, her daughter Fiona, and her son Kaylin, as well as her mother and sister. That's all for now. Keep checking back right here for more news.